Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Mark Woolery. I am the owner of Commencement Bay PC and Video. And this week's tip, or play of the week, is why you need a firewall. Now, what is a firewall? Well, glad you asked that question. All right, so a firewall is, it's a software program. It kind of acts like a middleman, okay? Like between your computer and the network, such as the internet, okay? And the job of that firewall is to keep you protected from the constantly changing internet threats that are coming in and trying to attack you at all times. And so the Windows firewall is going to protect your PC by blocking communications that might actually be dangerous software trying to get into your PC. For example, a Windows firewall is going to always allow you to be able to share files or, or like a printer between your computers uh, in, you know, in your home, but it uh, won't block any threats coming from the internet. Now, what does the firewall do and not do? Well, it does give you protection from network attacks, say, like in the form of malicious software known as the worms. But the firewall does not protect you from viruses or spyware. And I'll show you how to do that later in a video coming up later this week. So let's go ahead and take a look on how to set up your Windows firewall. Come on down here to the lower left-hand portion of your computer where it says Start. And you'll want to go to Settings. In control panel okay it's right here and then you want to click on security center okay and let's see for for the sake of it we'll go ahead and turn that off okay so I had it on so what you want to do is you'll want you'll see right here that the firewall is off okay and that's not good not only do I not have a firewall on I don't even have antivirus and that's not good, but like I said, we'll get back to that later. So come on down here, and we'll click on Windows Firewall. Click on that, okay. And you'll see that the Windows Firewall is not on, it is off. And this is not recommended. So what we want to do is click on, and it says this setting blocks all outside sources from connecting to this computer, with the exception of those selected on the Exceptions tab. Now here's the exceptions tab right here and these are the exceptions that I have allowed to connect to my computer from the outside meaning like you know like Acrobat, Dreamweaver, uh, Windows Live Messenger and Remote Assistance and so on. So I go ahead and click OK and by the way you can add other programs you can add anything you want on here any exception you want you can add Camtasia you can add uh, www.google.com or whatever or whatever type of uh, program you want to run you can you can allow it to to uh, access your computer by clicking add program and then typing in the path as the where it's at on your computer and then clicking OK okay so we'll click OK we'll cancel out of here click OK and now your Windows firewall is on so let's go ahead and take a look at that we'll shut the firewall off again okay shut that down and we'll go to start settings control panel security center okay and then you can see that the firewall is off come down here to windows firewall click on and click ok and now your firewall is on and your computer's somewhat secure except for that antivirus and like i said we will get to that later but i'd like to thank you for stopping by Commencement Bay PC and Video. You can find us online at www.commencementbaypcandvideo.com. If you have any questions, come on see us online. We are located here in the beautiful city of Tacoma, Washington. I'd like to thank you for stopping by again, and we'll see you soon in the next Play of the Week.